my voice at this stage so um, to edit your smudge to smudge all right i want us to make use of this pixel pro first so you click on it all right then click on get a picture and import you can as well click on gallery pro saturation or we have fifth strength all right so this saturation has to do with the color of your drama is that okay and um, i wanted to have a little color but yet i will not want it to be too much good so come to this fifth strength
This margin you can see so just follow how you see me smudging it all right then you have here so let's balance all the colors now all right so 
uh, for the lips right so I use lipstick red on the color um, Copic all right so this is lipstick red how 29 all right so um for the song also just let me put it at color likewise I think it will be blending okay it's wonderful uh, let me see the layer for the feet okay so then let me put it to color okay and I think this is for the nails all right so just let me decrease the size a little good all right so I'm, I'm not satisfied with the skin let me check some things let me delete this color dodge note you can choose to put it there but I just use it mainly to, to smudge all right so I can choose to delete it when I'm done with my smudging just let me put this at 100% all right i think it's more saturated now so just let me duplicate this and let me try to cut out the picture okay let me merge and duplicate again all right so i want to cut out the head so i'll use my selection tool to select the head and the hand i want to cut out the skin from the picture is that okay so I will invert my selection if you don't know how to do that go to my youtube channel search for a video on how to remove your background all right so you see it there good so i've removed the skin away from the cloth can you see that and also from the head i mean from the hair rather all right so um let me do some color toggle with this picture all right I want to make it a little bit darker okay I think it's much better like this all right um, let me work with this color likewise let me see I want to reduce the saturation a little okay I think it's better okay mm -hmm. Okay, let me work on this again. All right, so all right, it's wonderful like this. Can we see? So the next thing to do is to um, to put our shades and our highlights. All right, so just let me put it here. I'll create the new layer on top and I'll put it on multiply. All right. Now, this will be the color I'm going to be using. I've shown you guys how to set your color platelet. All right. So you can watch all other tutorials on this YouTube channel, then you'll be able to access the video. All right. So I'll put the layer blending on multiply to hide my shades. So anywhere, this is how to hide shades. Anywhere you're seeing black. All right i mean anyway that is much more darker than other parts you had your shades to this areas do you get so if any area is light then we have to add a highlight also do you understand so you can see i'm doing my own shades now so it's something that needs your time but because i already know what i'm doing i've been doing it for a long time so i already know what i'm trying to do so please don't make it too obvious and just make sure you hide it add it that is what completely all right so for the hand now when we smudge it you will notice you have erased most of the parts now this is where uh one of our pictures will come in okay just let me create another new layer here and put it on multiply likewise just let me bring it downwards and reduce the opacity a little and you may be asking now what's the opacity I'm using. Well, just use any opacity you find interesting to you. All right. So I want to use it to draw back the hands that's deleted. You know the the joint. I have forgotten the name we call it. All right. So <clears throat> you are going to use your shades to 
bring back all of that you get so all of these areas all of the darker shades use your uh, shade likewise to revive it it can just be like that good so this area also all right so that's how you do to so all of the hangers and make it wonderful even if you are not seeing something there just try to put something all right use your creative thinking because it should actually be there if you check your own hand it is there likewise all right so <coughs> let's see all right so you move to the clothes after you've done adding shades to the uh to the skin color pick the dark shade on the clothes then you reset it a little you decrease the luminance all right then you begin to add your shades to your cloth it will also make it more realistic that's what i'm saying okay all right so the next thing we're going to be doing is to put our highlight put the layer on soft glow all right then i'll be using this color just let me reset it a little i will increase the luminance all right i can use white but i just decided not to use perfect white now in order for you not to be confused you can come to your color platelet here all right you can use your uh, c00 or c0 or c1 or c2 all right you can use use your w00 w0 w1 w2 all right so you can just choose to make any uh, the use of any of that is that okay so let me start the highlights please be mindful of your highlights okay just let me show you my opacity 53 good so you use your highlights to bring out the details of the picture you can see that so every single details you want use your shade to bring it out and your highlight do you get that okay so all these areas you use your highlights so add your highlights to every part of the body all right so i'm just making an example for you i come to the clothes likewise add highlights likewise to the clothes to make it more realistic all right can we see this good so quickly let us try and form a background for our picture all right so you click on this tool and click on fill all right so we have solid we have linear fill and we have radial fill um well hold this tolerance don't bother to go there just leave it at 120 is that okay it it's um, a more graded fill that I won't want to take you into for now so that you won't have to start uninstalling your Autodex. All right, so just come to this linear view. Let me make it that. And then you drag from where you want. Okay, just let me shift it to the lips like this. So the first color here, you can choose to toggle it and uh, just let me come to my colors here. A lighter blue. Okay, let me make it a little bit more lighter till it seems as if it's white. Okay, I think it's much more better. All right, so the second color here, to know the area you want to put your color, just click on into the circle. All right, and then you come to your color, and then you change some things you want there. All right, so to the last color now, you can see where I'm clicking into the circle, and then you just go to your color. All right, and let me choose this last color. All right, um, not dark enough. 
just let me choose under okay i think it's one of these good can you see all right um i just noticed something on the leaves so i'll bring this color up can you see so just let me decrease it a little all right i think it's a little bit better great so just let me show you my layers once again all right so if anything seems confusing to you all right you can hack so let's continue i'll create a new layer on top of this and uh, try to detail my button just a little just let me choose my inky pen and put in white color that's good so that is one of the purpose of um, sketching Right, so just let me try and decrease the first. Okay, I think it's better like this. Yes, it's better. All right, um, I think I won't highlight the lips very well, so let me go back to the highlight now. Like I said the other time, let's come to a color cover. You can use your C00 or C or C0. All right, so let's go with this to detail the lips just a little. Can I see something? All right, I think that's wonderful. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so let me talk with this color once again. All right, yes, so. I think I'm done with this for now. It's the okay guys. So check the highs, watch the tutorial on how to detail the highs. Alright. And then the skin included in the sketching. Alright. Thank you guys for watching. Please and please if you find all of these tutorials interesting or you find it as something that can help another person, please do well to share this YouTube link. God bless you as you do so.